Okay, I don't know how to. Guys, okay, so welcome to Food Challenge Fridays. <laughs> Camera angle. <laughs> you know what that's about? Yeah. The bios. <laughs> bios, thank you, Jerry Ward. Welcome to Food Challenge Fridays. Today is Friday. You gotta keep messing up, man. Ah, oh, all right, get this. Oh. All right, guys, so. Welcome to Food Challenge Fridays. Hopefully I get this video out on Friday for once. Uh, today, the challenge that we will be taking is in Port St. Lucie, and it's at a restaurant called the Cheese Steak Factory. Not Cheesecake Factory, but Cheese Steak Factory. And um, this challenge entitles a six pound challenge. It's a cheese steak. This, as far as I'm concerned, it's a cheese steak. Um, I know we have a one hour time limit there, uh, we have been on the road for almost an hour and a half. Uh, we are about to be at the restaurant, but we had to make a stop at Walgreens because we both had to use the bathroom miserably. So he's going to be uh, partaking in this challenge today. Uh, I've been kind of, um, I guess, greedy on food challenges and doing the ones I want to do. So I asked him to pick the one that he wanted to do this Friday. So that's what we are doing. And, uh, that's enough rambling. Let's get to the restaurant. Let's hope to kill it. Yeah, we will kill it. Sorry. Confidence. Yes. Your destination is on the right. I don't see it yet. <laughs> it's right there. Oh man, it's like really hidden kind of ish. Oh, it's kind of small. Sweetness. So I told him we were gonna be here at two. What time is it? 1.56. Two o'clock. Oh, beautiful timing. All right guys, so the order has been placed. Uh, me and Alex are sitting here awaiting this uh, six pound, what is it called? This six pound monstrosity. It is called the Beast. Um, and it's a three foot long with five pounds of um, filling in it. And in the filling, it has steak, cheese, chicken, bacon, sausage, onions, peppers, and mushrooms, which sounds really appetizing right now. But uh, we'll see how I feel like in the meantime when I start eating it. You know how at first it feel, it's all good, and then you know after you get a couple pounds in or something like that, it's like uh, you're just eating because you have to. But yeah, so I will definitely show you guys when it gets here. My buddy Alex right here is a little nervous. How are you feeling though? Nervous, that's it. Nervous? I don't know, we'll see what happens. Oh man, <laughs> you gotta be confident in it. Confidence, buddy. So we'll definitely show you guys it when it gets here. All right guys, so here is the beast. So like I said, you got some steak, mushrooms, green peppers, bell peppers, onions. Um, a lot of good stuff in there. I think there's even chicken. Yeah, you see chicken right over there. And you got my pal Alex over there with his. So this is about five pounds of filling and about one pound of bun, so six pounds all together. And we're gonna give this about just one minute to let it cool down and get started. So see you guys when it gets started. All right guys, so the food is here. We gave it about a minute to cool down. Um, we're gonna have uh, the, the person uh, count us down. So we have one hour to complete this. Um, if not, we gotta pay 30 bucks, and if we do fail, it's free. So, um, I'm ready when you are. Ready? Yeah. And go. Boom. So, we have started my timer, and then uh, we're gonna take off now. And we're gonna start with this. It's hot. So halfway point, we have one of the trays done and we still have this other one. Right now we are about nine minutes in. And I know you guys asked about why don't I put a timer on the bottom of my video. It's because Final Cut Pro doesn't allow you to do it and to speed up the time for some odd reason. But um, hopefully they fix that error so I don't have to use the iPhone at the time.
Guys, just a little update. So I am um, have my last bun. I ate all the meat. I got little scrapes in there, but this is the last piece of bun that I'm going to um, dissolve right now. We are 30 minutes and 30 seconds in. And Alex, how do you feel right now? I feel good, but not good enough to finish. So he has tapped out. Um, I've been there. So we all know I've been there. I know exactly how he feels. Um, so I can relate to that. But uh, we're gonna finish this last piece of bread. But and hey, then, uh, continue I, on. I technically didn't fail because I have a Phillies for a week. True that. Lunch for a week. Yeah. Alright guys, so this is the last piece of the challenge. So we can go ahead and um, finish this and then pause the time. Boom. 35 minutes and 30 seconds. Well, we have completed the beast challenge. Um, that was a lot of meat. All right. What are your thoughts? It was good. All in good fun. Taste got a little repetitive. Didn't really want to keep going. Not exactly full, but that's how the good All right, guys. So. We just got out of uh, the cheese steak factory. Um, so what I did win is, apparently you're supposed to win a shirt, but I think they were out of shirts. But they did pay me in $50 and refund um, the money back that they charge you pre and in case you do fail. And I do have a $50 gift certificate. You can't even see that because the wind is blowing. But they gave me a $50 gift certificate that I probably will never use. Um, Memories. Yeah, just memories. I guess it just go in the collection of gift cards and things like that. But uh, my man Alex, how are you feeling? Salty, huh? Yeah, pretty salty. Uh, the taste got extremely repetitive. I wasn't able to finish it, but it wasn't a big deal because the price wasn't too bad um, for the amount of food you got. I chose not to go on, so I just I'm taking the rest of my fillies home and I'll probably eat them whenever I have a chance. Well, throughout the next couple of days because they'll probably spoil after that. So that's gonna be it for this uh, Food Challenge Fridays. We have a long way back home. Are we going home? We'll see. Yeah, we might have to make a detour, but we don't know yet. If we do, obviously we will show you guys and I'll probably eliminate this outro and redo an outro, so. We'll see, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed and uh, Peace out, bye. Peace out, bye.